Hi friends, welcome to Storybooks and Art. Our book today is called Caterpillow Fight. So I see some caterpillars, but I also see some pillows here. So I think this is gonna be a silly book. And then we're gonna make our very own little caterpillar out of some puff balls and a piece of paper plate. It'll be lots of fun. We'll need our bottle glue for this one today. But let's find out who wrote this book and who did the illustrations. Our author is Sam McBratney and it's illustrated by Jill Barton. So let's get started with our caterpillar fight. Oh, look at all those feathers. They must have feather filled pillows. When the caterpillars went to their caterpillar beds, they all had caterpillows for their caterpillar heads. Oh, look, they're all cozy, aren't they? Look at that. One naughty caterpillar in the middle of the night woke the other caterpillars for a caterpillow fight. Oh, oh no. Two little caterpillars gave the caterpillow blows to another caterpillar on her caterpillar nose. Oh my goodness. The tallest caterpillar from her caterpillar height brought down her caterpillow with all her caterpillar might. Boom. Uh. The other caterpillars hiding down below watch the caterpillar feathers fall like caterpillar snow. Look at that. Caterpillar snow. It does look like snow. There were caterpillar thumps and caterpillar wax and caterpillar tummies and caterpillar backs. The caterpillar laughter and the caterpillar din went on and on and on until... What could stop all this fun? What could possibly stop all this fun? <gasps> Big caterpillar came in. Stop all this silly nonsense. I can hardly hear my ears. This caterpillar laughing will end in caterpillar tears. Uh-oh. Now, when the caterpillars go to their caterpillar beds, there's just one long caterpillar for all their caterpillar heads. <laughs> Look, what did mama, what did the grown up caterpillar do? They sewed together one, two, three, four, five, six, seven caterpillars to make one long caterpillar. So no more caterpillar bites. Look at that. All those feathers everywhere. All those feathers everywhere. Well, this is a fun, easy one, my love bugs. And I think that you're gonna want your bottle glue for this. And let's start out really easy. The first thing we wanna do is when we get out our puff balls, we wanna find the largest one. Everybody is a large green puff ball. And there should be two Google eyes in there. Two little Google eyes. So I would Use your glue and glue on those eyeballs first and set it aside to let it dry just a little bit. Let it dry while you're putting together the rest of your caterpillar. Okie doke. So, and glue can get sticky and messy and that's okay. That's okay. There we go. So I got my little eyeballs glued on and then I'm gonna put, put this to the side to let it dry just a little bit, let it set. So now I have my kind of like S shaped little caterpillar and I'm gonna just start adding my puff balls again with some glue. And I'm gonna put dots of glue, one dot, one puff ball. Now you have all these different colors. You can make a pattern, you can put them in order, you can sort them out and put all the same colors together. You may have more um, puff balls than you need and that's okay, Miss Suzanne just gave everybody a handful. So, I'm gonna kinda try to make a pattern, see if I have enough here. I have pink, black, light pink, dark pink, black, and then a green and I have just enough to put my head Let's see here, let's see. Uh-oh, my head fell off. Oh. <laughs> there we go, 
there we go. This one's kind of hard to, because you got to let it dry for a little bit. But there's my caterpillar for my caterpillar fight. And there's glue all over my hands, and that's okay. So this was a quick one today, wasn't it, friends? So easy, so easy. And you might have a lot of poof balls left over, so you can make a couple more caterpillars. So fun. I just used a paper plate, but you could use a craft stick. You could go out in your yard and find like a wooden, like a, a piece of a tree that fell down, like a, a stick from your garden or from your yard and put a caterpillar on that. That'd be kind of fun. So whatever you do, I hope you have fun with it and have a good rest of your day. Bye friends.